I'm Clive Tippis, and that was a little piece by Fernando Sor, who is considered to be the father of the classical guitar. It's some of the music we'll be playing at our concert, Mozart and Friends, in the afternoon at Bottega on April 14th. Uh, Sor's music is really so well suited to these early guitars. It's difficult to imagine how uh, he could have written it any other way. It's, it's so much in the style of Mozart. It's so rich and beautiful. The harmonies are very simple, and the, uh, the l instrument is very light and responsive. It's just like the, the pianos and the, uh, the violins of the period. The strings are gut. In this case, I've made the frets out of ivory, uh, and that's a copy of the original instrument. The way these guitars are made is, is kind of interesting because the, um, most people don't ever look at the back of the guitar, of course, but if you look at the way it's made on the back, it's kind of like a violin, in, in, not only in the shape, but um, a piece of maple in this case is actually split in half and sawn into two pieces, and it's called book match. It's just opened like a book and glued together with a piece of ebony down the middle. And then the ebony idea is considered, uh, is, is duplicated in the so-called binding around the edges, and on the top there's, there's also a binding. In this case I've put um, ebony in the, around the rows of the guitar in very thin pieces mixed with some pear wood. And then ebony is used for the, uh, the little pins that hold the bridge. In this particular instrument I actually used um, the, the, uh, this piece made of the bridge is, is actually rosewood and it came from a, a broadwood piano from the 19th century. I, I had this idea that it's nice to give old instruments a new life by making some of the materials into a new purpose. I just love playing these early guitar pieces on uh, an early guitar because it, it's so well suited to the instrument. You'll be able to hear more of these at our concert. We're going to be playing some music with uh, guitar and piano together, and that's really unusual because uh, if you try to do that on modern instruments, it, it just doesn't work very well. One of the other things we're going to be doing is uh, we're going to be serving some coffee and pastry because that's what they would have done in the 18th century. They would have had the concert during the day, and uh, people would come, and it was a kind of social occasion. They'd come and talk. We're going to have a little exhibit of photographs and some, uh, some other guitars that I've made. So I, I encourage you to come and hear the guitar. Mm -hmm.